What's up? We're gonna talk about some sunglasses. What are a lot of my sunglasses? So obviously you probably know the ones that are Ray-Bans. They, um, I mean, obviously everybody knows who Ray-Ban is. If you don't know who Ray-Ban is, you've been living under a rock. So we'll start with, this is a pair I wear a lot. They are Trey Noir, Trey Noir. This model is called the Way Cooler. It is obviously a take off of the Wayfarer from Ray-Ban. Now, I do love Ray-Ban, but I also like to change it up because I feel like you kind of get stuck wearing the same exact pairs all the time. Every time I would go to the store, you know, I go look for a new pair of sunglasses, always ends up being Ray-Bans. I always leave the store with Ray-Bans. So there's a lot of other good brands out there that aren't getting enough attention, that are doing some new innovative stuff. This is one of them. So I actually, if I wear my three quarter helmet on my bike, I will wear, uh, these, they also make night glasses, so you can ride at night, they're yellow lens, and makes it so much easier to see, I don't know, oncoming traffic, or uh, the little old lady across the street. So, these are awesome. They make a polarized, they make one I believe that's not polarized, they're not super expensive, I think they're like 100 bucks. Yeah, highly recommend it. I will also put the link for these in the bottom. And this is what they look like. Pretty badass. Plus the case is cool. I'm a big person on, if I have a pair of sunglasses that I wear a lot, I like to have a solid case. These are very, very solid. Uh, they got the little anchor on here, nice little touch. Another brand everybody knows, or should know, Persol. Uh, Persol was made popular, I guess, mostly by Steve McQueen. Uh, I have those at home, I don't wear them as much. They, uh, it's not that I don't like them. I mean, we've just seen a lot of them. These actually, I like a lot. These are the Persol Handmade in Italy. Um, I will put the link in the bottom. I don't know the exact name for this model, but I will put the link. These are great too. Kind of a classy look, good for like brunch, going out to lunch, whatever it is. Yeah, I love those too, I wear those often. Persol's cases are great too. Well, they're made of real leather and the glasses fit perfect in there. There you go. These, oh, I just got these. So actually I was on a job in Austin, Texas. There was a guy on set, uh, one of the photographers, he's a really, really cool dude. And he had these on and I had never seen them before. Let me wipe these off. But they are the model of these. These are Billy Reed's. The Billy Reed's uh, partnership, I believe with Crew, they partnered together, K-R-E-W-E, -E, to create these sunglasses. I love them because Oliver Peoples, they have a, you know, the little dots on the side usually. These though have them on the front and on the sides, which I really, really like. There's a bunch of nice little cool touches. I can't really, anyways, there you go. But what I love about these is just the lens color and the way everything looks through them. They're super smooth. They work with all face shapes, just a solid, solid, solid uh, pair of sunglasses that I highly, highly recommend. These are a little more expensive. I think these, I think I paid 380 for these, but get them, take care of them. They come with a really, really cool case. The, the case I feel like could, they could do a little better on this for the price. It's kind of flimsy, but you can always, you know, use a, a more heavy duty case, but I do wear these a lot. Now we're going to move on. We've got time to two quick things about Ray-Bans. So I had to mention it, had to say them, because Ray-Ban is like Mercedes-Benz. They have a billion different models and variations of the same damn sunglasses. So, but they can do that because they're Ray-Ban. These are great. So these are obviously made in Italy. Um, I will, uh, I mean, I'll put the link at the bottom, RB2448-N710, 
1503 and thank you so much for making that extremely confusing. These are awesome though. These, if I'm gonna wear a wireframe, these are my go-to. I love the color of them, the tint, everything. So also another sunglass that I believe will work with any face shape and looks good with short hair, long hair, no matter what. They're kind of like a, a little bit of like a punk rock, old school vibe. I like these a lot. A, uh, my lenses, there. I've had these for a while though, they're pretty scratched up. But I just like the look of these. I've, the other frames, uh, or the, sorry, the other um, lenses, colors and everything for this frame, I'm not crazy about. It changes the look of the sunglasses more than you would think. But the light blue is just a really cool, uh, fresh touch that it, I think these are great. I get a lot of compliments on these as well. So I always wear these if I'm it's more dressy, going to a wedding, something like that. So that pretty much sums up uh, the sunglasses. I always update my sunglasses, so whenever I got a new one in the rotation, I will come back and talk about it. Here in the meantime, I will post below the link. A lot of them are sold on Amazon or things like that, but I will post the links at the bottom. Please like, subscribe, let me know more of what you want to see. I do enjoy doing these. I enjoy you guys' questions, and I do take time to read them and put those into motion so that I'm able to get answers to you. All right, I'll see you next week.